a small process, but uh, it's, uh, uh, Sheila, she, she spoke mostly about corruption. And uh, she showed you how actually you can really see corruption, you know, by, by checking these big buildings and assets with politicians were buying. Uh, now we will also we will talk next hour about uh, assets, but in different way. Uh, not about corruption, but we will see what actually organized crime is doing with assets and why it's important to track assets in, in terms of organized crime. And you will see that it's not all about uh, fancy villa, villas and, and, and built buildings. So. Also, uh, it's important that uh, most of you followed the, 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 the post training because I'll try to skip this, this part about uh, how to trace uh, uh, data about offshore companies and I'll do something reverse. I'll show you how you can actually find the data about offshore companies and this hidden partnership inside of your country, no matter which country it is. What can prove discrepancy between their income and expenses? And the way of living, no? The way of living. Okay, well, let's start with that. Why, so, why is it important to know about someone's way of living?